Yo, I've been telling people this Dubai place is whack, bro. Like, I know bare men who were living in Dubai for a period of time, bare men who are buying property in Dubai, and I keep saying to them, I do not see the appeal. One of my boys who got rich off of crypto, he was telling me how he's moving out there because um the morals and stuff. And I'm like, bro, you've been listening to too much Andrew Tate, bro. Let's be real. When we go to Dubai, what are we doing? We're cheating prozies, bro. That's what we're doing. What are we doing when we go and do... Bro, when we was in a hotel, I swear to God, bro, I saw drag... What are they called, bro? Dra drag queens going to a private room, bro, when I was staying in a hotel, bro. Expensive hotel. I'm not going to say which one. I saw drag queens going upstairs, bro. Do you think that's meant to be allowed here? No, bro. They're hypocrites, bro. I'm telling you. These Emiratis, low-key, they're gay, bro. You know what I'm saying? There's nothing wrong with that, but, it, but they, they punish you... But they'll give you three years for having a zoo like Fredo. You understand? I don't know how people can live in this hip hypocritical place. It's such a whack place, bro. And on top of that as well, when I came there, three out of the five times I've come there, I've been stopped. You know when you're done, you go through security, they rescan your bag, da da da, and you're coming out and you're ready to go get your taxi, yeah? When you're coming through there, there's a last line of security. Three out of the five times I've been to this shit hole, I swear to God, the exact same man has stopped me three the, three out of the five times the exact same man these guys are racist i don't care these guys are racist that's why i refuse to go there and give them my money on top of that as well you go get your svr you get your big boy rental car out there yeah you can't even speed bro when you're on these 10 lane highways yeah you're on these 10 lane highways that look good oh my god in dubai modern order but well, shut up man there's speed cameras every half a mile Every 0 0.5 miles, there's a speed camera, bro. I owe these lot, like, bro, the rental guy is still messaging me because I owe them, like, four bags in speeding tickets, bro. They are never getting that, bro, because I'm never going back to that place, bro. Man, them, do not shout me to go to Dubai, bro. I'm not going there, bro. I'd rather go to Qatar or something, bro, or some... I don't even know, bro. None of them, bro. I don't care, man, to be honest, because... Like, people get lost in this facade, bro, when in reality, when you actually talk to the people there, you realise how fucked this place is, bro. And you realise how, like, these lot don't have their passports, bro, or these lot make this, or they can't leave. Like, bro, you realise how messed up this place actually is, bro. It's complete. It's fucked, bro. And on top of that as well, I don't know how people go to this place and don't spend money and have fun. It's impossible for me to go to this place and have fun without spending money. If I don't have an SVR, I ain't happy. If I don't have a nice hotel, I ain't happy. If I ain't going spending money on drip or something, I ain't happy, bro. If I don't like, what else is there to do there, bro? Go to a fake beach. Or drive around in a hundred pound rent or dead car, bro. What, what is there to do in this place, bro? I don't understand why people go to freaking Dubai, bro. Go to Africa, bro. Go to Ghana. Come to Grenada, bro. Go, like, bro, come to... There's so many safe, small Caribbean islands like mine, bro. Come to my island, bro. Bring your money there. Stop giving these people who don't like us a freaking money, bro. I'm tired of it, bro. You three years for a zoo. Like, when people are telling me I want to live in Dubai, I'm like, are you joking? Are you, are you mad? Are you tapped, bro? Like, and the worst part is as well, people say as well, I'm going to address every single thing that people say about this place. People say, oh, there's no tax. You don't have to pay tax in Dubai. Bro, you don't get citizenship. That's why you don't pay tax, because they don't give you citizenship. Jesus, when you're paying tax to stay in other countries, yeah, it's because the end goal is to get citizenship. So you're going to contribute to this country that you are in the future going to be a citizen of. This country will never give you citizenship, bro. You'll never get citizenship, bro. And you're bigging up this place, this Dubai place, bro, please. Like, fam, this is passion because I hate this place with a passion, bro. I do not like Dubai, bro. Why do people go to this place to get three years for a zoot? Allow it, man. Anyway, I'm in Manchester, bro. You know what I'm saying? But I'd rather... Listen, this place is terrible. Manchester's the worst place ever. I'd rather live in Manchester than live in Dubai, bro. And that speaks volumes.